We're in the fourth industrial revolution. Every day we hear about new technologies springing up, which the experts tell us are going to change the way we live, the way we work, and how we do business. After the pandemic-induced lockdowns, we saw a rise in the pace of technology adoption and a shift away from physical channels to more digital channels. One particular technology which has made ways for a while is Bitcoin. I've made previous videos explaining what Bitcoin is in 10 minutes, as well as delving into the dark side of Bitcoin. However, Bitcoin does not exist in isolation of the blockchain technology that it runs on, along with many other cryptocurrencies that have risen since Bitcoin went mainstream. LinkedIn also ranked blockchain as the most in-demand scale of 2020 and beyond. So in this video, I'll explain very simply what blockchain is in just five minutes. Stay tuned. Hello friends, my name is Jeremy. Welcome back to the channel. If you haven't yet subscribed, please consider doing so because on this channel, I speak about digital transformation, adult strategy, and personal development. Let's start with some quick and very simple definitions. Blockchain is the technology that enables the existence of cryptocurrencies. A blockchain is typically defined as a distributed ledger that is open source and decentralized. But what does that mean? As the name suggests, a blockchain is a chain of blocks that contain information stored in a digital format. The technology runs like an open digital timestamp that everyone has access to. Because of this feature, when information is stored in a blockchain, it becomes extremely difficult to change. If you take Bitcoin for example, the kind of information that would typically be stored in a Bitcoin block would be the details of the sender, the receiver, and the amount of Bitcoin being sent. In addition to the data being stored, each block also has what is called a hash. A hash can be compared to a digital thumbprint because it's a unique identifier that represents all the information contained within each block. A unique hash is calculated each time a new block is created and if any of the information in the block is changed, that hash changes as well. This makes it easy to identify if a block has been tampered with. Additionally, the hash of the previous block is also contained in the new block, which is what creates a chain of blocks, hence the name blockchain. Because each new block contains a hash tied to the previous block, if the digital thumbprint of a block changes, it's no longer the same block and can no longer be tied to subsequent blocks, rendering them invalid. To further increase the security of a block, there's also what is known as the proof of work. Because there is computing power that exists today to recalculate the hash of a block even after tampering to avoid detection, proof-of-work exists as a mechanism to slow down the time taken to calculate and add a new block to the chain. If you tamper with one block, you need to recalculate the proof-of-work for all blocks in the chain, which is really no easy feat. The combination of hashing and the proof-of-work construct is what makes blockchain technology so secure. To add on to that, the blockchain is not managed centrally but is distributed, meaning everyone can join the blockchain and verify that everything is in order and create consensus. So to successfully tamper with a block, you would need to tamper with all other blocks on the chain, redo the proof of work for each block, and take control of more than 50% of the distributed network. Only then will it be accepted by everyone else on the network, which is near impossible to do. Blockchain as a technology is constantly evolving. New use cases for blockchain are constantly being identified. Players in the various industries such as the financial services sector have started acknowledging the potential and disruptiveness of blockchain technology. Blockchain isn't limited to only being the base technology that drives cryptocurrencies like Bitcoin. It has other applications such as the creation of smart contracts, digital voting, digital health records, and digital ID verification. If you're looking to stay ahead of the curve in disruptive emerging technologies, then blockchain skills are highly recommended. If you like this video, remember to give it a thumbs up and drop a comment below, and I'll see you in the next video. Cheers, guys.